turned in here tonight. That is what they will be. EA Sports. It's in the game. Pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the field. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponent. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 146 pounds. Fighting out of Temecula, California, Big Ray. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. The fighters touch him up. but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. He loaded up there on that high kick. Just missed. Oh, 
Nice offering there with the knee. He talked to us a lot about that on Thursday. Felt like the knees would be there. It was certainly there on that exchange. He knew they would be available. He just knew he would have to find the right opportunity and right time to land his Plus right hand is true. Boom! Straight right. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, do you believe that another head kick lands? Got to start raising that guard or this is going to be the end of the fight. You got to start raising the guard and guiding that head kick down back towards your cheek. You cannot take him clean and you cannot take him alone. Try to establish that jab. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Kick to the body by Lee. <laughs> Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, nice job to block the kick. Lee gets touched by that kick to the body. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great timing to land that punch. Back and forth we go! And he landed the right hand there. Wow. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Nice kick. It's very tricky when he throws that body. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Oh! All right, he engages in the single collar tie. How good is that right hand? that knee to connect to the body, and if you're the defensive fighter here, you got to make sure you don't eat too many more of those. You cannot eat too many. You've got to get the elbow to the side. Otherwise, you're going to land one that's going to shut everything down. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Got clip with the right hand. So there it is, taller fighter landing a knee to the body. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Great punch. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. 15 seconds. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You could really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind your jab. Oh, man, this is one thing you do not want to get kicked in the head anymore. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead, and I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him, too. That was so impressive to see. Someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to show up the defense here, though. Punches blocked. 
All right, so he's landed some good shots. He hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. And both guys really throwing with authority. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Close guard. Well, these are some excellent ground and pound strikes here, DC. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw, exactly when to hold, and it's allowing him to really control the grappling aspect of the fight. There's a song there, right? Know when to hold him, know, know when, when to hold him. Yep, absolutely. Go. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. He's putting him in exactly the positions he needs to be in right now. He's able to relax here. And he understands, being a veteran of so many fights, that as long as he's on top, he's winning. He feels like he's winning here. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. A lot of different looks. He switches to southpaw now. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Unable to land with that punch. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Great punch, landing with so much power. And they separate. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Back and forth we go. Just missed with the straight left hand. Look at how he turns his hips into that leg kick. Impressively done. So at long last, he finally lands his first takedown after several failed attempts. You knew coming in that he was going to stay committed to the takedown, kept on trying, and finally got him to the ground. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Back to the feet now. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Ooh, found a hole for that knee. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Oh, lands an elbow. Didn't open him up, but very well could have. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. 10 seconds remain in round two. Gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. But let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round.
right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to... Oh, this fight's gonna be over DC. What a great way of mixing up his attacks. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with the corner button going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. That's a big strike right there. Just missed with the left there. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Pretty significant welt to the left side. Single collar tie now. Big leg kick land. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Right hand on point. Oh, Superman punch. Well, Take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Yeah, he fixed it all up. He gets caught with that punch. Powerful leg kick lands. Lands with the right hand. Oh, shot to the body connects there. He hasn't really thrown too many body strikes and lands a double leg takedown. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Oh, so an interesting decision there as he decides to stand up and relinquish the gun. Oh, man, now he's hurt. That's one of those shots that if you take one of them, if you end the night, that one landed right on the spot. Liver kick. The center line slips the punch. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Big punch land. Ooh. That kick blocked by Lee. Pretty good right hand. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. What a body kick. Boom. Spinning back fist. Digging kick. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Went for the inside leg kick. Big punch lands through the middle. And now he's got that tie clinch. We'll see what he can do with it. Right left combo by Lee. Oh, knee strike right to the bottom. We got a fight, folks. He is throwing a fast three. Double leg here. Look at how fast. The only person I can do this to is Baby John. The weight difference, I don't know if you know jujitsu much. You miss a lot of your class. If I'm gonna do this to anybody, it's Eddie. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Wow, what a kick! <laughs> nice punch here. Lands a nice one, too. Another strike to the body here, really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. Really timing his shots nicely, good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Looked like he might have landed there instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. 
is throwing a fast, straight car jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Oh, it's there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. Look at him on the stool. He's still wobbling this round. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here's round four, fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Oh, what a punch. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he needs to start looking at the finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Now he's on top of him looking for the finish. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. All right, working inside the now open guard of his opponent. Uh-oh. Throwing up a triangle. The guy on his back is very good at submissions, and if he's not careful here, he's going to get stuck, and he will have to submit. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. All right, north-south position now, DC. We'll see how he chooses to advance from here. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here for bottom. Recovery, man, right back to his feet. Nice punch lands over the top. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Ooh. Back and forth we go. Oh, big left. Just out of range with that right hook. Nice punch by Lee. Trying to establish that jab once again. section there. Oh, straight right. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Wow. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Up again, you gotta like that. Switching stances here. Nice loop with punch. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Beautiful kick. up on his body. That is going to hurt something fierce. Oh! Oh, he tasted that knockout line! He tasted the knockout line! He's done! He's done! Woo! Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming, so back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight.
there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 45 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon. So there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do to find the knockout. Now he can celebrate with his family and friends as they earn this spectacular victory. What is perfect now?